Welcome back everyone to Magius Plays Met or AM2R. Last time we took out all the Metroids in this area. And this time, we're wrapping things up here. Going in into the geothermal pl power plant. And getting a fairly important upgrade. Now this area is definitely not looking the best. Well, we've been... They've been hitting at something rather spicy in the area. So, this is where we need to go to get it. Uh, not much we can do up there right now. So, down we go. Deeper and deeper. Now there's definitely something a little bit eerie about going into a place like this and seeing it ruined. The only life being mechanical and it being eerily quiet. Well, except for the background music. I'm sure Samus loves putting that in over her headset to give her a bit more feel for the area and get her blood pumping when she's in those big boss fights yeah, nothing we're going to be able to do there for a bit Here we have the power plant. A pretty cool power system. But the more important thing is we've got power bombs. Just like any other game. Go, set them, and they go boom. Oops. But now we need to get out of here. That set off the balance on the power plant. Which means that if we're not quick, we're gonna boil. And of course, they throw in a boss fight for us.
Now I gotta restock. And now we gotta go. Now we could have tried going the other way, but that would have gotten us a whole lot of nowhere. Of course they want us to go fast. Yeah, this, uh, this section definitely ramps up the tenseness of it. Thing damage isn't much of an issue, except it slows you down. And if you go too slow, you do go boom. And you can see it's getting pretty tight. And though we're making pretty good time on this, it's not letting up for an instant. Come on. Now we have to wait for these and... Come on, come on. Boom. Yeah. You can't actually make it out of there without it going boom. However, as I said earlier, if you wait too long to get out, it goes boom before you're out of there. So, it's a lot more, you have a lot more leeway in getting out than you'd think, but you still don't have a lot of leeway in getting out. But now that we have the power bombs, we've got a couple things we can pick up. Like more power bombs. Uh, let's see. There's also something. Well, we can go in here now. This is right back where we started our journey in this area. Which will let us come here and get the super missile tank that was hiding there. Now we can also head back out. Oh, can't get hit out this way. Uh, 
I saw that one coming. So we head up and out. And back around the tower. Can't go back that way. Dang it. Let's go ahead and refill our fire bombs over here. And there are a couple things that we can grab back in the power station. Not there. Not there. Right. Over here. Now, most of this area is now completely ruined. But there's still some stuff we can do here. Yeah, find the right way down. And there's a section we weren't able to get into before. With an energy tank. Which is very nice to have. Need to do a speed boost here. Grab on here. Blow that up. And that gets us to another missile tank. Kind of a tricky way to get it, but... Yeah. Once you know what to do, it's not that hard to get. If you don't know how to get it, good luck figuring it out. Because that is definitely not obvious. And that wraps up everything there. Now to head on to the next area. And take care of some business. Although first... There was an area earlier where they said stuff had caved in. Well, we've got super missiles and power bombs now. So why don't we go up there and see what we can do. Those guys don't stand much of, a ch of any chance against us now. Can't block our shots. They can still block our way, but that's a minor thing. Now, somewhere in here think here. Yeah, need the speed boost there. Of 
for more missiles. here. Yeah, if you remember the log for the research step, they said they couldn't They'd been blocked off from the or the research area. They said they'd been blocked off from their ship by a cave-in. Well, power bombs get us right through that. And take us up to the surface of the planet. For another completely new area. And looks like the people on the ship did not fare any better than the people outside. But before we do too much in there, uh, the GFS Thoth. this side we have some power bombs always nice to have don't do much against Metroids but they wreck most other stuff and back in here have a couple things we can find Like an energy tank and an enemy to fight. As you might see crawling around up there, the Genesis. The one to just be patient with. When it jumps down, hit it. it. Has some attacks that can hurt, but overall it's a really easy fight. Especially if you've been gathering up gear like I have. And there you have it. Deals a bunch of damage, but it's not really that big a threat if you've been collecting the gear throughout the game. Might as well go ahead and fill up here. Get things, everything back up to full. Not quite done here yet. One more bit of map to explore. And it's telling us where we can find that thing we just <laughs> took care of. On the other side of this area is one more thing to get.
they're gonna might as well shave a little bit of time off the proceedings. And more power bombs. That's about all there is to find here. We can go explore up in up into the sky, but that actually hurts us. So let's get back and head on to the next area, shall we? Here we go. Deeper and deeper and deeper we go. I couldn't get through there without the power bombs, so you'd have to do the power station. You don't have to do the landing ship, however. Now this area makes things a little bit interesting. Once you get in here, you can't get out again until you're, you've are you gotten pretty much everything you need here. And there is a lot of water to deal with, and we are not well suited for that yet. tough getting around right here but once we get in get some stuff taken care of it's going to be a lot more interesting if nothing else then because it's the most expensive area in the game But we'll be getting into that next time. For now, just need to find the save point. These things go boom. So if they're in your way, hit them and get out of the way. Here we are. I'll wrap things up for this episode, so tune in next time for more AM2R. Hope you all liked and enjoyed this, and until then, see you soon.